Leo Austria on Beerman's Game 3 loss. We were not smart in the end. Manila, Philippines Leo Austria walk out of 10 results 112. The 104 Game 3 loss to Ray or sign in the PBA Commissioner's Cup to Nismos with regret in his heart and adjustments in his mind. Already just a win away from the final spurt, the Beerman left a chance to wrap up their series against the Alaska Painters slip away and gave the opponents a shot at even tying it. We're not smart at the end game, said Austria Wednesday a smart around the Coliseum. We're not able to convert our shots and not only did we miss them but we also rushed them. You also have to give credit to the rain or shine players because they not those three-point shots. If they could have missed a few of those in the end game then we would have won. San Miguel turned a six-point deficit, 86, to 80, at the start of the fourth quarter to a 96, to 90 when lead after a fish and follow free throw cast off a 16, to 5 run, with 623 remaining in the game. Rain or shine, though, launched the final offensive and took control of the match in the last minute and a half. Gagnor was knocked down a three-pointer from the left corner to give the Alaska Painters a 105 to 104 lead with 114 left but it wasn't just on the offensive end that the veteran forward made a huge impact. Mpalo, who has 51 points, was called with a traveling violation with 30 seconds to play after Norwood blocked his lay of attempt. Yu Belga, who has 15 points, 7 rebounds, and 6 assists then shot the dagger with an off-the-dribble triple against the defensive five-time MVP Jean Mar Fajardo with 11.2 seconds left to play. San Miguel's low lead in the fourth quarter was an obvious biggest concern, though since he root watching fellow light up the box sport while the local spittled. Fajardo, who averaged 14.8 points and 11.3 rebounds, was silenced to 8 points and 4 boards while Chris Ross, who had a career best 10 triples for 34 points in game 2, was limited to just 6 points. One of the things I regret is our in-court played well and had 51 points but we should be happy about that, said Austria. On the other side, us coaches think that he should have involved his teammates more. But the breaks didn't go our favor. Chris missed his shot and there were instances we thought he were fouled but no whistle were blown and that's just part of the game. I just told the team that we should be positive and move on. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe.